And what I dream for us is that the women in this room, I know that we can have a national voice. A voice that is not about Mexican, Cuban, Puerto Rican, Colombian, Guatemalan, but about our shared values, about our love for our children, about our families, and that our voice will be heard. I dream that politicians will come to us because we're that important and won't just give us false promises, but will have to prove to us what they're going to do for us before we just, they assume we're going to vote for them whether they're Democrats or Republicans. I dream that all the women that I see in this room that are already leaders, that those women will be experts on Nightline and 60 Minutes and CNN, because I never see any of you. Nobody knows we exist and we're killing ourselves. And I want to see a Latina on the frickin' view. Hello? Really? Like, duh. We're only the biggest group. You'd think you'd check us out. We only have a zillion MacArthur Genius Award winners. I dream that every woman in this room and that all Latinas in this country promote each other. There is a big movement in America by American, and they're right. And I want to see a sign on everything that says, made by a Latina. Yeah. <laughs> and that Latinas buy from Latinas. You know, a lot of women always say to me, when somebody comes out, a Latina comes out with a book or a movie, and I said, did you buy the book? And they go, well, it's, I didn't like the book. I go, well, if you only wrote one book, you're going to write a crappy book. <laughs> Maybe but if you buy the book, she'll get to write 10 books, and the 10th book will win a Pulitzer. <laughs> we have to buy from each other. I buy Isabel Toledo shoes at Payless myself. I want you to know that with the numbers we have, if we just bought from each other, we'd all be rich. <laughs> Truthfully, we would. I dream that we all, that, we'll, that we could really be secure that everyone in this room will watch each other's back. We don't have to like each other always, we're human but we can't say that in public. <laughs> I want to know that no matter how much I screw up, all the Latinas are watching my back. I want us to feel powerful enough that we can speak for those who can't speak for themselves in our community. And that we will stand up for them. That we don't allow other people to abuse the people in our community that cannot speak for themselves. Those are members of our family. And last but not least, I dream that my little son and all your children and all the children I meet in schools will know who all of you are 